This is the demo of all-in-one Instagram scraper. The all-in-one Instagram scraper supports scraping uh, Instagram profiles, Instagram followers or followings, scraping posts of a user, scraping comments of a post, scrape likes of post. So let's start with the scrape profiles feature. So you can provide a list of Instagram usernames or Instagram profile URLs here. You can bulk upload the list of profile URL, Instagram profile URLs. Before doing a demo of scrape profiles, I'm going to scrape followers so that I get the profile URLs and then I, I'm going to pass it to scrape profiles feature. So let's start with the uh, scrape followers feature. So once you select a particular action, you need to go to corresponding section. So in this case, I selected scrape followers action and uh, now I have to provide the profile URL to scrape the followers under scrape followers section. In order to scrape the followers of any Instagram profile, you need to uh, provide your Instagram cookies. So to get your Instagram cookies, just click on the question mark here, install this extension. I have already installed this extension, so I'm just going to click on the extension icon and then click on export button, which is a fifth button from the left. So once I click on this export button my cookies will be copied to clipboard i'm coming back to this page and uh, i'm going to clear the contents of this field and then click on and paste my cookies here so you can configure general uh, you can configure these options like deep scrape each profiles and start from particular cursor this i will explain these options later so number of records required and uh, proxy I don't know for some reason uh, residential proxy doesn't seem to work for uh, uh, Instagram scraping. So uh, I recommend you to uh, keep data center proxy and uh, let the choose proxies automatically option enabled. This way it works fine and uh, select a minimum and maximum duration. Uh, the more delay you provide it is better for your account. So like 10 seconds, 2 seconds to 10 seconds, something like that. And then click on save and start. So now let's uh, let's look at the results. So it already scraped 50 followers of Mark Zuckerberg. So Instagram uh, limits the access to number of followers to 50 followers for verified users so because of that we cannot scrape more than that so it's it says that only zuck can see all followers so if you switch to json format you can see the all the available information for the followers if i, I can download it in different formats here json csv xml or all these formats and i can select certain fields so download so this is the csv file exported csv file so we have all the fields here now i'm going to try script profiles action so i'm going to choose script profiles and i'm going to configure the script profile section so here I am going to do a bulk edit and uh, I am going to pass the profile uh, usernames that I have scraped recently, scraped in the last run. These are the followers of Zuckerberg. So I am going to copy and uh, paste it on this field. So now I have around 50 followers usernames. So I'm going to leave these options as it is and uh, click on save and start. So as it scrapes the profiles one by one, let's look at the data available in each profile script data. Let's look at the script data. So these are the fields available in scrape data. So 
so it has lot of information here so for now I'm going to export these script results so okay so I am going to select the required fields so So I have selected all the fields I want to export and I'm, I'm now I'm going to click download. So let's see how is the exported data looks like. So I now I have all the followers uh, list with all the details that I selected here. So I have all the bios, all the names. Follower counts. So external URLs, I have external URLs here. So let's look at the next option which is script posts of a user. So I'm going to go to script, script posts of user section and uh, I'm going to provide the profile URL of the user. So the profile URL should look like this and uh, let's save and start. So there are a lot of available information about posts. So you have complete information for each post, nothing is missing here. You won't get more than this much details in any other scraper. And similarly I'm going to show you how to scrape the comments of a post. Okay. So I'm going to select scrape comments of post and then I'm going to come to this section scrape comments of post section and then I'm going to click on a particular post and uh, copy the link to the post and uh, paste it on here and uh, save and start So this is the comment text you can see here. So <coughs> all the comments are going to be scraped with maximum details. It also contains details of user. So, so minimum details of a user including the username, full name, IDs and profile pictures. So next is scrape likes of a post and go to this post so liked by these people similarly I'm just going to copy the link to the post and uh, put then put it here so script likes of posts Let's see how we can use it, use it from an ABI. So let's go to ABI endpoints. <coughs> I'm going to use the run actor synchronously and get dataset items ABI because I'm, I'm, I'm going to get the results in one single API call with this uh, API. <coughs> so I will paste the uh, API with the API token post request and going to go to go to body raw JSON so now I need to pass the actor inputs so I can get that directly from this page 
so you just have to go to uh, input tab and click on switch to json editor and then select all and copy this uh, json code and come back to postman and paste that json code here okay you just need to specify the action you want to perform so if you want to scrape likes of a post just keep the action as scrape likes of post you can get the list of possible values for this field from the documentation section go to input section and scroll down so here you will see the select action perform action field name and possible values here okay if you want to scrape likes comments and uh, friendships then you will need to uh, provide cookies if you just want to scrape the profiles you don't have to provide the cookies then you can pass the remaining options like deep scrape uh, minimum and maximum delays proxy settings the options related to selected action okay so if you selected the scrape likes of post action then uh, you need to prof pass this field that is pass this field and the profile uh, and the post url so pass this field and post url so we don't need to pass the remaining uh, fields if you are which are not related to scrape likes okay so just uh, this field and the general options fields and click on send so if you check your api fi account uh, you might see the runs so it's already running this run is started by the api call so let's wait until we get a response so we already got the response here so we got complete list of people who like the post like the post